Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Kayla and welcome. So I recently shared these protein packed mason jar cob salads on my latest healthy five day meal prep video and they were a huge hit. Y'all absolutely loved them. So I figured they deserve their own dedicated video and blog post. The salad in a jar method, also known as mason jar salads, is truly a game changer if you wanna meal prep your salads in advance while keeping those ingredients as fresh as possible and keeping that lettuce from getting too soggy. So if you're trying to eat more salads during the week to get in more vegetables, fiber, nutrients, and protein, but you don't have time to make them fresh every single day, mason jar salads are the way to go. And they're perfect for healthy lunch prep because you can just grab and go. Each cob salad is packed with 40 grams of protein, eight grams of fiber, and only 454 calories. And this does include the Greek yogurt ranch dressing, which by the way, I will have a dairy-free option for y'all. And as always, you can print off the recipe card over on the blog post. I also have the full macro count listed over there as well. I'll have that linked for y'all in the description box below. But anyway, let's head to the kitchen and get started. Let's prep all the individual ingredients first, and then we can start to layer the salads. I'm going to get the eggs boiling first. You'll need five eggs. And I like to wait for the water to start to boil first before I drop the eggs in. And I'm going to boil them for 10 minutes. Okay, while those are boiling, let's get the chicken breast going. You'll need one pound of boneless skinless chicken breast and you can season it however you'd like but I'm gonna add sea salt pepper onion powder garlic powder paprika and poultry seasoning and I'm just rubbing that all over the chicken breast to speed things up, I'm gonna cook the chicken in my pressure cooker, but of course, you can also cook it in the oven. I'm just adding that to the pressure cooker pot, along with a splash of water. You can also use chicken broth, but you wanna add enough liquid to cover the bottom of the pot. And then I'm gonna pressure cook it on high for about 12 minutes. And going back to the eggs, once they're done, let's drain the water and then give them a quick ice bath to stop the cooking process. After they've soaked for about 10 minutes, you can go ahead and peel them. All right, setting those aside, let's get started on the turkey bacon. In a skillet over medium heat, you'll wanna cook a total of 10 slices of bacon and just cook them on each side until they're fully cooked through. As you can see, this cob salad is loaded with protein-rich foods, which is gonna to help to regulate your appetite and keep you full all afternoon. Okay, once the bacon's done, set it aside and let it cool while we go check on the chicken. And once the chicken's done, you can go ahead and shred it up with a fork. Set the chicken aside, and once the bacon has cooled, I like to cut it up into small bite-sized pieces, and I just use my regular scissors for this. Don't forget to chop up the boiled eggs as well. I like for them to be a little chunky, so I'm gonna use a knife instead of a fork. All right, now that we've prepped everything that needs to be cooked, while those things are cooling off, let's prep all of our veggies and the homemade ranch dressing. You'll need two cups of diced cucumber, and I like to sneak in cucumbers whenever I can because not only are they super low in calories, but they're also great for promoting hydration. They contain a good amount of vitamin K, which is great for your bones. And of course, it's an easy way to get in extra fiber, which is gonna help to keep you regular. I'm also adding two cups of cherry tomatoes, and I'm just cutting those into halves. Tomatoes are rich in lycopene, which is what gives them their deep red color. And lycopene may help to reduce your risk of heart disease, certain cancers, and even help to protect your skin against sun exposure. I'm also chopping up one red onion. Now, if you're not a fan of raw onions, don't worry. You can totally leave it out or you can substitute it with carrots, celery, or even chopped broccoli. And for the lettuce, I'm gonna be using romaine today, but really any type of lettuce or leafy green works with this recipe. Just make sure you rinse it really well. I like to soak my lettuce in water with vinegar and baking soda just to make sure it's super clean. All right, let's give it a good rinse and make sure that the lettuce is fully dry before you add it to the jars. Lastly, let's quickly prep the ranch dressing. Now I'm gonna be making a Greek yogurt ranch dressing today to sneak in extra protein and to cut the calories. But if you wanna make my regular ranch dressing, I will have that linked for y'all in the description box below. So in a mixing bowl, add in half a cup of avocado mayonnaise. And I'm using my homemade mayonnaise recipe today, which I'll have that linked for y'all below as well. 
half a cup of plain unsweetened Greek yogurt. Of course, you can also use plain dairy-free yogurt. One teaspoon each of dried dill and garlic powder. Half a teaspoon each of dried parsley, dried chives, onion powder, and black or white pepper. A pinch of sea salt. And one to two teaspoons of lemon juice. Let's give that a good mix until everything is fully incorporated. And I like to add about two to four tablespoons of water just to thin out the consistency a little bit and make it go further. All right, it is now time to assemble our mason jars. And with mason jar salads, it's all about how you layer the ingredients to ensure that they stay fresher for longer in the fridge. Let's start by adding two tablespoons of the ranch dressing to each jar, followed by the cherry tomatoes, the diced cucumber, and the chopped onion. Now the key here is to add all the high water foods to the bottom of the jar first. And this helps to keep the other ingredients from getting too soggy. Next, let's add the chopped boiled eggs along with the shredded chicken and the turkey bacon. Now with the meats, it doesn't really matter what order you layer them in. The main thing is just to make sure that they're closer to the top of the jar. And lastly, we're gonna pack in as much lettuce as possible. The more you can add, the better, because that means less air gets into the jars, which is gonna keep the salads fresher for longer. Let's add the lids, and these protein-packed mason jar cob salads are ready to go. Each salad has 40 grams of protein, and they're also loaded with fiber and nutrient-dense foods, so they're not only gonna keep you full all afternoon, but they're also very nutritious. And whenever you're ready to serve it, just dump everything into a bowl, give it a good toss to make sure everything's coated with the ranch dressing, and then I like to top it off with one-fourth of an avocado just to get in those extra healthy fats and nutrients, but it's really just that that simple. Dump, toss, and enjoy. Well, all right, y'all. That is it for today's video. My protein-packed mason jar cob salads. Like I said, these are perfect if you need a healthy lunch meal prep option that you can just grab and go. They're full of nutrients and fiber and protein. It's everything you need for the perfect healthy lunch. Don't forget you can print off the recipe card and calculate your macros over on the blog post, which I will have linked for y'all in the description box below. But if you're enjoying my healthy meal prep series and my healthy meal prep recipes, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up to let me know and of course I'll continue making these for y'all and also you can uh, tag me over on Instagram in any of your recipe photos or your meal prep photos and I will share that on my stories but anyway that's it for today and I'll see y'all in the next video bye